Hi, so just to conclude our demonstration here, I'm going to log into uh, an ESX server here uh, and then take a look through the file system uh, and show what the uh, the VM volume structure looks like. Uh, and again, it's very similar if you've ever logged into ESX, gone through the uh, uh, VMFS and then into the volumes, you'll see that's where all the uh, data stores are. Um, whether they're SAN or NFS connector, in this case VM volumes, we see our NetApp container one. Let's CD into that and take a look at the contents. We'll see the a test vvol and the clone of that, uh, the directories are in there. So let's uh, cd down into that uh, test vvol. And we'll see here a very familiar, if you've ever done this on ESX servers today, VMDKs, VMX files, very familiar. Uh, what I'm doing now is I'm taking a look at a tool called uh, VMKFS tools and I'm looking for the option that uh, will let me do a snapshot of VMDK and this is it, option uh, capital I. So let me trigger that. Um, and I'm going to pick our test vivo one, uh, one of the VMDKs in there, and I'm going to uh, take a snapshot, call it snap.vmdk, and we'll see that this is extremely quick. So this has gone through VAI, making an API call to VASA, then onto the ONTAP controller. Uh, ONTAP has taken the snapshot, we see it's already done, this is almost instant, and we'll take a look at the directories. And there we have it, we have a snapshot of VMDK. That's really how fast it is to take that snapshot.